Okay. Uh, so next, we need to figure out where Ariel is. And those guys don't need to be a part of it. We actually want to go back to Triton's Forum. I think the keyhole they seek is somewhere in the palace. Now, my dear, if you can take me there without your daddy knowing. How were you able to... Yeah, well, where is Triton to leave the the trident there and not be with it? Like, they just, did they just catch him when he was in the bathroom or something? Oh, also, Goofy's with us now, because uh, Ariel's not with us anymore, obviously. So... Yeah, let's head to the throne. Maybe we can uh, catch Ariel. And Ursula. <laughs> the trident is mine at last. And I couldn't have done it without your help, my dear. So he must have come back. I didn't want this. And she must have injured him. Aren't you tired of following your dear daddy? And now she's orders? being a not nice person. Oh, yes. We had a deal, didn't we? Time for a little journey to the dark world of the heartless. We cannot find the keyhole. The keyhole is not here. What? <laughs> Why? We have come. Chaya knows where the keyhole is, I think. Wait, <laughs> but of course he's not gonna tell Ursula. Also, she called me handsome. Daddy. So it's not right. ugly, I guess, but we must get it back. Come on, let's go. Wait. I'm going with you. Okay. My father is hurt, and it's all my fault. You were a pretty I good fighter. I don't have any Ursula. complaints with that. I don't... That's you don't have to right. convince me. I'm right behind you, Ariel! It would be hilarious if Sebastian became a, uh... Became a party member, too. So Triton there is telling you how to win. <laughs> when you fight Ur uh, Ursula. I think in here... Yeah, I believe this is a save point. I'm gonna use that real quick in a second. Yeah, okay, I was just checking to make sure there wasn't any other uh, items or anything. We haven't saved since we've been here, so this is useful. Okay. So we need to head back to the sunken ship. Oh, hey. First, we're going to fight this new enemy, the Aqua Tank. It holds a bunch of uh, screwdrivers. That's its thing. Uh, but I think I can just kind of warp myself back to the uh, sunken ship. Got AP up. That's nice. Um, yeah, I think I can just kind of warp myself back to the uh, sunken ship, because you've seen how to get there and whatnot. Although. I think we'll uh, splice in a quick uh, figuring out what I, I'm going to add to my abilities uh, before we do that. So let's uh, kill this last guy and uh, do that. Although I kind of figured I'd be done talking before I had the ability to do this, but we have four. I want, I really want Leaf Bracer. Treasure Magnet's also good. Um, but I really want Leaf Bracer, so I don't even think I'm going to actually put a new ability on him yet. Oh, you can take this. I don't care about Ariel. Uh, is he have two cheers? No charges. That. I think I want to wait until I can give one of these to Goofy. Oh, maybe Evolution. Evolution's nice. Anyway, okay, sorry. Uh, to the second ship. There we go, second ship. Okay, made it back. I believe the shark is here again. Um, but we want to actually... 
it's not the time. I thought that was what I needed to do. Come on. Who's fighting? Oh, shark's back. Okay. Let's fight the shark, and then we'll uh, do what we need to do. I think we need to fight the shark first is the issue. I think this is why they were saying I needed there's something else I should be doing. Cool. Shark's down. And now I was doing I was doing the right thing. We want to investigate that switch. Our friend Sebastian is supposed to be with us. He might be able to hit it. Yeah, here we go. Thanks, bud. And now we progress. The Den of Tides. We're gonna get rid of these guys. Mainly because I want their MP regen. Well, not mainly because, but I do want their MP regen. We're going to stick to the right here to start. Let's find the cavern nook. Where's a save point? And a mega ether. I'm going to hit the save point real fast. And then we're going back out. Because the way we're supposed to go... this way. Because this is the Tidal Abyss. Ursula's Lair. Oh, well, maybe not directly Ursula's Lair yet, but we're getting closer. And I got a trophy for killing a certain number of Heartless. This is kind of creepy. These guys, could they do anything to me? Or are they just here? They're just here. I don't like them. There's Ursula's there. Your time has come. So now we fight Ursula. The whole thing with this one is that we can't hurt her. Uh, did she get knocked out? No, she's still. That's not what I wanted to do. I need to lock onto the cauldron. We can't hurt her. Really, until the cauldron backfires on her, yeah. And stuns her. Which I don't entirely know is what happened already yet. No, yeah, I can't hurt her yet. Uh... Once the cauldron backfires on her, ouch! Oh, I hit her. The hit her. It's supposed to stun her. Once it does, you can fight her eels. Fine. This is an annoying fight. I don't like this fight. I've never liked this fight. Um. It's supposed to backfire on her once there's enough fire in it. I don't know how much fire is enough fire. I also need to heal. There we go. And now you can just kind of pound on her. Come on, guys. Max this damage out. I'd like. I'm not going to one cycle her, but I'd like to. Yeah, we already have him. So basically, when she met, when she does the man up and fight thing, it seems is when uh, her eels. Uh, or that's when it backfires. I just missed with both of those fights. Do I have? I at least have one either. Aha! Backfire. So yeah, basically just fill it with 
fill it with uh, fire until it backfires on her. And then hit her as much as you can before she comes to. Ah, uh, she came to. Okay, I need to charge up some MP, so I'm going to focus on these guys for now. Also, I could use a potion. Okay, well, you brought him back. That's okay. It's an annoying fight, this one. Okay. That might be enough for her to, uh... Backfire? But I can fire one more, I think. It did not backfire. This is where it's going to take forever now, because I forgot to equip ethers. So my only regen right now is her, uh, her guys. Although, I don't know if I'm doing any damage, but I think I was doing a little bit of regen when I hit her. I just need to kill, float some, and jet some until they continue to come back to life. So I can put more fire in there. It back, it's backfiring. Did it hit her? Doesn't look like it. I am regenning. I don't think I'm doing any damage, but I am regenning when I hit her at least. Well, I need to throw another potion. This is not going very well. I'm glad I have potions. Can you guys not hit them, please? I need to, uh... Uh, what does that do? I need to be able to hit the, uh, hit the eels. If you could not, I would appreciate it. Ouch. Okay, I'm like, okay, I'm doing okay. On magic, that's at least... I got two. Oh, it back, did it backfire? Where is she? Oh, we won! I guess that last backfire killed her. <laughs> cool. Hi. Cool. Uh, mermaid cake is helpful. Make sure to equip it. Also, I'm going to put more items on because I used too many. I'm going to throw my last two ethers in here, honestly. Uh, and then it's a shared ability of mermaid kick. Basically, it lets you swim faster if you press circle repeatedly, like this. It's useful for getting out of currents and stuff, but first we gotta leave the lair. Well, but first we're going to we're going to use it against currents and stuff. But we want to leave and come back because there is a sea urchin here now. Ah, oh, right there. Ouch, how do I... Fire. How do I blow it up? Oh, like that. <laughs> and uh, spawns a chest for us. Containing mithril. All right. One more spot to go. We want to go to the calm depths. Which aren't really very calm, because now that we have this kick... We can go against the tide. I'm gonna kill this first. Which way are the calm depths? You can get to the calm depths here somewhere. Is it? Nope. That's not where I wanted to go. Uh, 
Oh, I almost just went back where I was. Where is the calm death? I think it's this one. Yeah, it is. Thanks for arrow, I guess. Um, we can swim against the tide using the circle thing. And I think this is where I want to go. This is where I want to go. Hi. Uh-oh. So this is the real Ursula fight, though I would uh, I would um, classify the last Ursula fight as the real as Ursula fight. Um, but I can actually do damage to her without uh, needing to stun her first. So she does the sucking it. She does like thunder attacks and thunder strike attacks, which are easy enough to just kind of swim out of. She does that sucking. Uh, attack which is super fun to dodge you just have to uh, uh ouch you have to swim away from it with mermaid kick the thing is the annoying thing is that a good number of her attacks are based around her face oh yeah ouch that one i didn't even remember she had that um a good number of her attacks are based around her face and like using her mouth to do things and that's where you need to be to hit her i mean i could like i guess uh do that ouch how about a blizzard oh she's about to bite me she bit me so it's a lot of it's just swimming around, trying not to get eaten by this giant sea witch. Which I'm doing pretty poorly at, the, the, the not getting eaten by her thing. Although getting around the back of her head seemed to be the best option there. I'm just kind of enduring a lot of her thunderbolts. I don't care about your bubbles. Also, you can't turn when you're using Mermaid Kick. Oh, wait. Yeah. Are you done? You should finish. Ouch, she didn't finish. Some respect? Also, where'd she get the, uh, where'd she get the crown? Did she just magic that for herself? Has she always had the crown? And I just noticed it now. I don't think she's always had the crown. Ouch, those bubbles hurt. What is she? I'm not doing very good here. I mean, I'm doing fine. It's just kind of an endurance test. If you can take her moves, she's gonna bite me. Or shoot lightning? I said heal. That the, the thunder breath seems to leave her out, or leave her uh, winded for a minute. So that's always good. I have to heal as soon as she's done inhaling. You didn't even taste anything. Well, I guess you've bit me enough that you know what I taste like. I'm just going to try to power through this. Uh, maybe not. If I can just get a couple more hits off on her. It'll be good. There we go. Cool. Level up. I think I want to put second chance right on Sora. I know I was saving up for Leaf Bracer, but... Bye!
And now I get the trident back. Thankfully. It's the same crown that uh, Triton was wearing. Yep, that that makes sense, Triton. You let her set up her grotto little holding area in the same room as the keyhole. Yeah, there we go. Also, we get Thandara now and Anson's report number three. We'll read all of the Anson reports uh, later. For now, let's go to Ariel's Grotto and uh, oh, we'll close the keyhole. It seems like we're pretty safe from Heartless. Maybe I'm just going too fast. I think I was just going too fast. No, I think we're safe. Which is funny, it usually doesn't happen until after we seal the keyhole that there no Heartless spawn. But, you know, we'll take it. And Ariel has the trident. So this is what I like about uh, Kingdom Hearts One World. You're not just following the plot of the movie for the most part. Like Kingdom Hearts, th this here, Ursula was evil and yada yada yada. But th this was not the plot of the Little Mermaid. It was just things happening in the Little Mermaid world. And I really like that about Kingdom Hearts One. Your world? It doesn't really end up like that in the later about games. That. Sorry for lying to you. You kind of just play through the plot of the movie in the other games. Besides annoying. I probably talked about it already. Maybe I can too. So many places I want to see. I know I'll get there someday. I'll find a way somehow. I'm sure of it. Keep dreaming, Ariel. Well, if you find it, do me a favor and leave me out of it. And that's Atlantica. Well, first off, Crab Claw, new Keyblade. What does it do? I'm pressing. I feel like I'm gonna use it. Oh yeah! Wow. Nice new Keyblade. But that's Atlantica. I don't think we ever have to come back here until uh. Until we need that one Trinity. Um, but that's Atlantica. We're done. I'm just going over here because this is the closest save point for me to uh, go back to the gummy ship with. So yeah, we're done with uh, Atlantica for now. Um, next time, we don't have like massive cleanup to do. We don't really have much cleanup to do. Really all we have to do is uh, some Traverse Town stuff. Really, it's the, um, the, the the torn pages is what we're going to deal with. But I am going to do that next time. I don't know words I'm saying right now. Uh, next time, Traverse Town for some stuff. After that, this world, a battle level six world, although we did find a battle level seven world, uh, but we'll deal with that another time. Battle level six world is two parts from now. Traverse Town, 100 Acre Wood is next part. I'll see you then.